I I am actually responding to a quote a politician said, Doug Holliday, and his quote written here says, uh, well, I certainly think it's really not the ideal place. No. But what he, to get to the point, what he's trying to say is um, he doesn't want kids in the city. He doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> um, so these are a few of my friends. And we go to this place called The Big Chill very oftenly. And it's her favorite place. It's in the city. <laughs> um, and I have lots of friends and we all enjoy being together. We meet up um, sometimes and just go crazy. So, and I would have known these people unless I've lived in the city. And um, there's always something going on in each neighborhood. They're all unique and this is Little Italy and some Italian performers during uh, Taste of Little Italy, I believe. And yeah, I'm learning uh, cultural traditions. It's a, a tea ceremony in High Park where um, there was the uh, uh, I forgot, sorry. But, um, yeah, this is uh, Chinatown. It's very busy. And the people you meet are very, they know a lot. They're very, they, they know their culture. And, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm getting sage right <laughs> This is me in the suburbs. Because I have grandparents there, and I like to go hiking, and I pretty much have a foot in both worlds, from the suburbs and the very populated city. So, this is Luminato, and it's an art festival. And art festivals are among my favorites, because there's music, and there's a lot of people we know that participate. And there's lots of people. Uh, this is me at Skadden Court. And pretty much what I'm trying to explain here is when you're sitting on the couch, you're thinking, what am I going to do today? You can go anywhere. I went fishing in a swimming pool. <laughs> and it was very enjoyable. <laughs> This was actually at Jack Wayne's funeral, but um, we all had bikes because it's not dangerous to go in the city and ride a bicycle, go do something. So this is, this is another thing you could do in Toronto. I wouldn't. I sometimes just lay around, but otherwise I'd go rock climbing with my uncle. And this is Kensington Market, my favorite place in Toronto. There's the pedestrian Sundays where parties are all around, there's music, and it's, it's a really fun place to go. You should try it if you haven't. Um, this is when I was around like five years old. I was, this is um, an ice cream parlor. I think it closed down, but uh, me and my friend Maisie, uh, it's, everybody was nice to us. Sometimes people would s sneak us little snacks. And, um, AGO, uh, Toronto is very kid friendly. I don't see why you wouldn't want to raise a kid here. We're at the AGO, I'm here. Friend I actually have here. Um, you can also go grab a pizza down the street like I, I did today. But Doug Holliday does make a few points that we shouldn't let kids run around in traffic trying to get to the park before the traffic light changes. 
and that's pretty much exactly what I'm doing here. <laughs> it's also a thing, if you're not used to the trash and everything you'd experience after your, like, if you don't experience it earlier on, it'll become a bigger problem in the future, like these smells, garbage. <laughs> So, I spent a few years in England, and one of, uh, this is in Canterbury, but I spent most of my time in London, which is one of the densest, busiest, um, whatever you can describe it, city in a lot of places. But this is Trafalgar Square, eating gelato, I think. And you can see how busy it is. I don't care. It's fun. <laughs> yeah, there, as you might have seen, there's like people pushing their babies around. This is Adventure Playground. And my friend Ferran me when I was like six. And uh, there's Adventure Playground. They're, they think, and we'll just let these kids dangle above six feet with on a rope. And, you know. This is another one of me in uh, the suburbs. I, I like the suburbs, but I prefer the city, because I'm a city boy. And we're having a picnic in the snow. And I like the suburbs for that, because there's lots of snow. And, yeah. 